Enjoy this cool weather while it lasts because it is going to get hot very fast. I'm meteorologist Dr. Athena Masson. We have that nor'easter setting up and moving away from the sunshine state. So a high pressure system will be able to move in beginning late tonight and into tomorrow, but also monitoring this next low pressure system deepening off of the Texas panhandle. That could be our next system. That's mostly going to be for the panhandle though, and will be arriving later in the week. As for our high temperatures later on this afternoon, all of that cloud cover from that nor'easter helping to suppress our temperatures still. Many of us only rising into those mid to upper 60s, 67 about for your high in Gainesville, down to Ocala, 68 in the villages. A few isolated locations could get to 70 degrees. Most of us will stay in those 60s. Throughout the evening and into the overnight, mostly cloudy conditions continuing. Maybe a few peaks of sunshine throughout the afternoon, mostly cloud cover. Temperatures lowering down into the 50s. But by midweek, I'm calling it the super warm up. That high pressure will begin to move eastward. That's going to help to deliver more of a south southeasterly flow. That's going to crank up our moisture values, not in the form of rain, but in humidity. By Thursday, some of us could be approaching 90 degrees, and those could be some near record temperatures for some locations. Over the next few days, the warm up begins tomorrow, rising on up into the 70s. For the most part, across the week, we'll be able to see a mix of sun and clouds. By Thursday, very warm temperatures. We could get into those upper 80s, a few locations hitting 90 degrees.